Hello and welcome to today's episode of Jim's Raw Cooking. Today, unfortunately, we've got my sister with me, um, and Hello. who's there? Um, and we'll be making, as you can probably guess, cupcakes. Well, these are special gluten-free cupcakes. Wow. All right. So, what are we doing first, Lizzie? I have no right. idea how to make this. You need to put your butter, butter. Your sliced unsalted butter, wow. 150 grams, yeah. into a microwavable bowl. I do. Like that. Wow. I've done it. And then put that in the microwave. And you want to microwave it at a low... Low... Temperature. Yeah. That's not the way. Losing your own size of that. What do I do next? Okay. Put your sugar in a bowl. Put my sugar in a bowl. The big bowl. Oh, yes, the big bowl. Big bowl. Cast the sugar, 150 grams. Yeah, what she said. All right, and we're waiting for the microwave. We're waiting for the microwave. What are we doing while the microwave is happening? Do we need to crack our eggs? You can crack your eggs. I'm cracking my eggs. So we've got three eggs. Medium. Medium. Oh, that. Wow. Oh. It's not good. All right, so we're using this as our extra bowl thing, and I'm going to attempt to crack it. I'm dreadful at cracking eggs. Yeah, I know. I'm not a pro baker like you. Do you want me to show you? No, it's that. fine. Brilliant. Yep, so, um, this is a stealth cast request to make so I do more baking. So this is what I'm doing. I'm baking. Um, and Lizzie's got the microwave butter. The uh, microwave. just touched all the eggs on the other side. Um, okay, Good hygiene. Well, yes, wow. Okay, what am I doing next? You put your butter in your sugar. Butter in my sugar. Butter in my sugar. And you want to cream it, which cream. is like... Mix it about. Quite a lot. Okay. Like beat it. Yep. Like the Michael Jackson song. Yeah, I like that. Pop that in time. Wow, are you ready for this like, professional baking? Wow. You bet you wish you were this professional. Mm. I bet that's really tasty. Is that done yet? Oh, I've done yet, Lizzie. No, you want to do a bit more. A bit more. Keep going. Alright. You oh. can do this with an electric whisk that's to make lazy it a bit people. easier. We're professional, Lizzie. We do it by hand. Alright, uh, just so you should know, we've heated, preheated the oven to 180 degrees Celsius. I have no idea what gas mark or Fahrenheit that is. It's a fan because oven as well. It's a, yeah, it's a fan oven. Because metric is the best system. And all other systems will, be, will perish before the might of the metric system. I mean, that will do. Alright, so we're done with this now, apparently. <laughs> Right, what we're doing next, we're putting our flour in. You want to beat your eggs? Beat my eggs. Whisk. Wow. You can turn the camera around if you want. No, it's fine. Okay. Beat it. But is that about ready yet? Beat it. Is that ready yet? Yeah. Yeah. Beaten. Thoroughly yeah. beaten. Wow. Beaten. Alright, and then put that in there. Gradually. Gra gradually. Now, it usually curdles, but, you know, if you add them slowly, then it won't. But it still might. We'll just add a bit and then mix it yeah. about. YouTube channel, Jim's Raw Cooking. Well, truly I'm honoured. Um, yeah, you better be. Sure. I mean, I was watching a film, but, you know. Too bad. <laughs> Why would you want to watch a film when you can be in a film, Lizzie? Oh, well. Unfortunately, our, our budget is not as high as Mocking Jane Part 1. Sad. Just like the film that you're watching, because well, it's terrible. It's a good film. It's not, it really is. It's a good trash it's, film. Yeah, well, okay. The book's better. Yeah. 
I haven't read the book this one, actually. You have. Yeah. Jeez, Lizzie has been baking for many years and owns her own successful bakery, don't you, Lizzie? Of course. Yeah, Pedro definitely. Cakes, you can hire me on events. Yeah, totally. That happened like twice. <laughs> My arm's getting tired. Do you want to swap around? Sure. I'm ready. You're like professional. Okay. Professional, let me I'll just kick the camera. Um, is that a sexist joke? No. no. <laughs> 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 wow. Well, I can be the camera. Supposed to be pouring the eggs. Oh yeah, sorry. I can do both at the same time because I'm multitaskable. Multitaskable. I'm multitaskable. I wish I was multitaskable. <laughs> Alright, are we man. are we almost there yet? Because this is getting yes. really boring. As you can see, can wow. I Wow. You... Wow, you just hold it up in the camera. It looks like it's curdled a little bit, but when we put the flour on it'll all be fine. It'll all be fine. Lizzie guarantee. Not All right. That so thing. here's your sieve. Wow. You want 150 grams. That's 130 grams. 130 grams. I apologise. Of um, gluten-free self-raising flour or normal self-raising flour, only if you're special. You, know. you, you mean add? Oh, I can sieve. That's so much fun. There you go. You want to hold it higher because it gets more air in. All right. Go yeah. To my right. food tech teacher. Credits to Mrs. Lewis. Mrs. Lewis. Mrs. Lewis. And then you also want, have you put your baking powder in there? Not yet. Okay. Well, it's all frozen, so you don't need baking powder, but if you use plain, you would put more in. So I don't need to put that in. You can put a sprinkle in. Put a sprinkle in. Just let the whole top. It's a bit weak. Only a tiny, tiny, tiny. That'll do, that'll do. That'll do. That'll do. That'll do, don't you? And xanthan gum, which xanthan is very useful for gluten-free cooking because it makes it a bit like... How much do I need to put in? It replaces the gluten. You want like... Half of that. Half of one of these? Yeah. I missed. Why did I even put it in through this way? Um, but if you're doing non-gluten-free, you don't need this. It's for special people like Lizzie. Thank you. It's called celiac disease. AKA gluten people. You can find out more Wait, information uh, on um, in, celiac that, UK. Yeah, shut up. Uh, yes, just mix Four. it basically. Oh, okay. But don't beat all the air out. Yes, I know how that makes a difference. I don't know how it makes a difference. <laughs> just like that? Yeah. Yeah? Make sure you get it from down the sides. Yeah. You? Well, look, I'm turning the ball in it. Do you want to use a spatch? Not really. Right. You can use a spatula. We'll use a spatula in a minute. Alright. You want to add your cocoa powder? Cocoa powder, yep. Yeah. You want to sift it as well? You sift it. Sift off? Yeah. You better. I feel so threatened by you. You better be. Yeah, we're making chocolate cupcakes, by the way. Chocolate? Yeah, in case you didn't notice. It's, it's chocolate here. This is just made coloured flour. Yeah. I'm going to last couple of lumps with a spoon. Alright, yep. So this is my first pudding, isn't it? Um, yeah. Yeah. You've done a cheese tart, is that a pudding? No, that was, that was a, like a breakfast thing, kind of oh. traditional. New Year's rest, uh, meal thing. Oh, there you go. Some context. Okay. Oh, you've done um, pancakes. Oh, you yeah, did banana pancakes. That kind yeah. of counts. Pudding. Well, I wouldn't say I've made them. I attempted to make them. I'm going to start a rival YouTube channel. What, Liz, Liz Burnt Baking? Um, that's rude. You're rude. Thank you. I love you too. Liz, you are you... You got any shout outs you want to do? Um, shout out to all of James's sad this is, this internet is friends. Pretty, all of, pretty much all of my friends and none of yours. <laughs> shout out to James's friends. Wow, friends. wow, that's me. I don't think most of you are real. Oh. Um, 
James's imaginary friends. Shout out to Emily Brindle for the continued support. Wow, that's like one of Lizzie's friends. Yes. I, I was thinking, you know, whatever. Okay, is that done? I'm getting really bored now. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. What do we do now? Do we put it in the thing? Yes. All you right. need to yeah, put your cupcake in. Yeah. Like useless. Just food. Made yet. Get that out of the way. You oh, put it now we get the festus bit, which is like putting it in the cupcake here. Do you not have the like flexible ones? That are really the, the rubber ones? ones? Yeah. No, they're weird. You can't use them, they're better for the environment, but like they're all better for the environment. I think so too. Each, but I feel like two and a half. One Try not to like drink that. it. Yes. That's at least two and a half. That's quite a big spoon, yes. Big spoon for a big boy. Oh, are you really that big of a boy? I'm, I'm pretty tall. I'm not very big. You can't see how tall you are on camera, James. No, no. one's going to believe you. Well, this, well mainly because I'm crashing down half the time. <laughs> I'm taller than the tripod. Wow. <laughs> How would you rate my cooking skills list out of 10? Um, are you shit at or making pancakes? Seven. Yeah, I know that. Or am I allowed to swear? <sighs> Lizzie, this is a, a crisp no, it's not. It's <laughs> <laughs> Please don't fucking swear. Um, Fuck off. <gasps> you would. <gasps> yes, I would. On my YouTube channel, on the yours. famous Jim's Raw Cooking. <laughs> Now I'm gonna be world famous and he's gonna be making you. I'm gonna take 20% of the credit as being the only child in this family that can bake. If yeah, all of the ad revenue on this one video, you can take a 20% cut. Thank you. I'll give you that. Of which there is none, so. Um, one day. One day there might be. Achieve your dreams. Yeah. Don't forget. I wish to earn <laughs> one P on YouTube. <laughs> and then I will be more famous than Bird. Your cooking's not awful. It's pretty good. I mean, I like that pasta thing. I've not actually eaten most of it, because you always cook when I'm out. Fight me. Which is most of the time. The soups are the best. The soups are good. Apart from that here, one you made the other day. guys. Soup, the <laughs> soups are good. Independent <laughs> researcher. Soups are good. Soups are good. Four out of ten. No, four out of five. It's perfect five it's like out of five. eight out of ten. Alright, well, what are we doing now? Come on. Is it all in? Not yet. It's not all in. That's what she said. Thank you. <laughs> Lizzie, lick the spoon. No thanks. I'll lick the spoon. Licking the spoon is not good for your health, don't do it. Yeah, it's got raw eggs. 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 <laughs> do you just eat it raw? Is that why it's called raw cooking? <laughs> yes. I think you should do some filler music. Listen, you got a whole left bank too, Lizzie. What is that? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> We're amazing. Nice. 
Left bank two is the best elevation you do. If you say so. Alright, we'll lift the ball up. Alright, we're done. I can't be bothered to get the rest of that out. What are we doing now? You can use a spatula to get the rest of it out. Can. Put right, it in well, the oven! Wow! You ready? Superb camera skills. Wow, do you want to put them in the oven? Oh, why do I have to put them? Because you're, you're the pro oven. Put oven mitts on. This is the pro oven putter. Okay. Wow! Look! I've not got the brand. It's fantastic. I bet you couldn't do that that good. Wow! Wow! Elizabeth, you gotta go. We'll see you in a few minutes. We'll see you in a few minutes! How long are we waiting, Lizzie? 15 to 20 minutes! Wow! We'll see you then. Bye. Alright, so they're about done, and we're going to watch Lizzie check them. Um, so what, what Lizzie's going to do now, Lizzie's going to open the oven, she's going to pull the cupcakes out, she's going to prod them. Wow, the cupcakes. Lizzie's going to, she's going to prod them, probably. Wow. Camera ring. You, get, you, you also get your skewer. Put your skewer. Put your skewer in. Pull it out. If it's clean. If it's clean. Then they're cooked. They're cooked, yeah. It's not clean, stick them in. Um, if it, right. You can also poke them, can't you? And they're supposed to spring back on there. Yes. Alright, so they're cooked, which is good. So you can turn the oven off, like Lizzie is doing now. And what we're going to do is we're going to... What are we doing next? Eat them. Eat. Oh, do oh, we have... probably too hot. Too. Okay, we're going to wait for them to cool. So we'll be back in a few minutes. Bye! And alright, so the cupcakes have cooled down now. So they are ready to eat. So what we're going to do is we're going to get a cupcake and we're going to share it because we want to save the cupcakes. So we're going to put it on the thing. We're going to cut it in half to prove that it's cooked. Start off with. We need the in there. All right. You ready? Wow. That's your heart. All right. Oh, it's quite light. It's, yeah. Wow. It's a cupcake. Wow. You don't want to overcook them. Thank you very much. Mm. What do you think, Lizzie? I think it's nice. Oh, it's great. You heard it here first. Alright, so, this was <coughs> <laughs> good with milk. Um, <laughs> um, this was the 31st episode of Jim's Raw Cooking, and we had co star Lizzie. Wow. <laughs> um, if you have any other suggestions, please let me know. Bye. Bye.